Hello everyone, welcome to Otaku Saga, I'm DK. I'm Rizzo. And I'm Zero, and today on Anime Reaction, watch episode 9 and 10 of Momo Curry. If you want to check out our reaction to the 9th and 10th episodes of Momo Curry, hit that link in the description below. Don't be sure to give us feedback in the comment section, because we love hearing from you. And as always, if you like what you see, subscribe to Otaku Saga. And don't forget to like and share our videos. And, and thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching. Double thumbs up. <laughs> so on this episode of Momo Curry, uh, well, we started off with Kurihara and her friend in, Ouch. in the mall. And I feel really sorry for the friend. Was it Mizu? Yama? I don't even Who's remember. Name? I only remember like three characters' names, and that's Momo, Kurihara, and Ryo. And that's it. Yeah. But, um. The important ones. But yeah. They run into Ryo there, who I guess was shopping for a new frying pan. Interesting. And it's revealed that Ryo, um, I guess, li lives with her single father. So she does most of the housework and everything. The struggle is real. It's amusing um, that uh, Kurihara. Is that right? Kurihara. Yeah. 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 Uh, she, when she w when Rio said that she was looking for a frying pan, Kurihara said, "Oh, you're such such like a housewife." <laughs> Awkward. That's probably why she took off in a hurry. Well, wasn't <laughs> after she said that, wasn't that where where um, where Rio did that awkward laugh? <laughs> yeah, just about. And then left. That's probably the exact reaction that would happen too, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out of here. Yeah, I, I need to go. <laughs> but uh, then most of the episode was the entire group at a park doing a barbecue. And I'm hungry now. I am too. That looks filled good. with meat that was gained by a horrible oh, meat. Oh. Yeah, so one of Momo's classmates, I can't remember his name, it's his older brother. His older brother was dating a girl, and she said that she wanted meat. So he ended up purchasing five kilos of, of meat. Which, by the way, if it's like premium, uh, he said it's premium grade that has a six month wait list. Yeah. And well, for those outside Japan, beef is expensive over there. Yeah. Because all has to be, you know, most of it has to be shipped in, or it's really extremely high quality Masataka beef. She might have been talking about some different kind of beef, different kind of meat. Anyway, no, so the, the meat was the meat was um, was. Uh, it, he had to wait six months for it. She broke up with him after five and a half. She wanted a different type of meat. Uh, anyway. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> but, so, he donated, I guess, the meat to the rest of the group and had this fantastic barbecue. Lucky. Yep. Yeah, it was pretty much just just a barbecue. Yeah. Like, I, I don't really have a whole lot else to say about it. Uh, we find out that two of the, um, I guess two of the, the classmates of Momo, um, their siblings? Yeah, their cousins. Their cousins. Right. Yeah. They're, they're cousins. Their parents. His mother and her father are siblings. Yes. So. But they act very close. Yeah. And it kind of, I guess, throws some people off. Uh, yeah. Yeah, in a way. Technically, like, the, the reason why you see a lot of the, the the cousin relationships as far as anime goes is because it's not... How do I put it? It's the cousins, cousins' relationships are not considered as bad over in Japan. Hmm. Yeah, so. it's, it's a little more normal over there yeah. than it is here in the States. Yeah, here in the States, it's like... Yeah, yeah you, you don't want to be in a relationship with anybody that you're even remotely close, you know, remotely related to. Yeah. So. But, uh, towards the end of the episode, we got, I guess, Momo finally got the courage up to say she's cute. And then backtracked, backpedaled, 
and said that he was talking about her swimsuit. Well, to be fair, uh, Curry Hard did kind of flash him out of nowhere. Right, yeah, just, <laughs> I wore this. Fucking bitch. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> the awkwardness is real. Uh, yes. But truth be told, not a whole hell of a lot happened in this episode. That actually happens, though. Yeah. It's like, oh, hey. Like, it, it's it's interesting because, like, some girls, they, uh, the, the swimsuit isn't underwear. Mm. Yeah. Um, so I've actually had that happen multiple times where they're like, I, I got this new swimsuit, but it's too cold to go swimming. Well, they told no, you I that there were. Yeah, sure. Well, I have had it happen before where a girl was like lifting her shirt as she was talking. Oh, so it was like. Didn't compute. It wasn't a, oh, it was more like a, oh. <laughs> 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 I'm a pervert. What can I say? Right? I like boobs. But, <laughs> it, you, you know, it's still one of those, like, oh, crap. Oh, okay. You know? Oh, reaction. Surprising. Know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. Mm. So. Um, and then next, next week, I guess we are going to be watching a festival episode. I love festival episodes. So do I. So do I. Kimonos. Well, you got it. You got it. Anyway, so let us know what you thought of the anime, what you thought of our reaction in the comment section below. Yep, thumbs up if you like it, thumbs down if you don't. But that's going to do it for this episode of Anime Reaction. As always, I'm DK. I'm Zero. And I'm Rizzo. See, See you next time. time.